Well, good morning, everybody. This is Jeremy Williams uh, representing Garden City Ammonia Program. And I uh, had a lot of feedback yesterday coming back from the video I posted. And I'm uh, going to try something new. Let's see if you guys want it and see if there's a need for it. But I'd like to start giving some education tips of the week. And today is going to be about oil and viscosities. And uh, I'm up here at the GCAT lab and just going to give you a, a couple of uh, shout outs. And um, so let's talk about oil. You know, when we look at our oil and our compressors, there's a lot of things that we want, but one is viscosities, especially for when the machines are off and on startups. Our oil should have uh, viscosities that are, are good for lubrication, both at both high and low temperatures. And um, let's just look at a couple things here. So I'm going to look at a cutaway uh, from GCAP's perspective. This is a Frick cutaway compressor we have. This is inside of chamber A. And pulling out this side, this is the heating element. And this heating element on this particular one goes inside of a well. And generally, we like to say that these oil heaters are on when the machine's off. Usually a thermostat kicks them on and off. And the idea is to make sure that the uh, oil temperature, at standby temperature, is at least 10 degrees hotter than what we would call saturation pressure. So if we looked at an existing system right now that has currently got a live charge coming over here, we're sitting roughly at about 90 pounds of pressure. When we look that up, that's 54 degrees. And when we look up 54 degrees of a condensing, boiling temperature, as long as the oil is hot as that, hotter than that, there ain't no way liquid ammonia can condense on top of it. So um, be careful starting up your machines. When the oil's cold, it's thick. Uh, you never want to go out there and start your car on a cold winter morning and just give it gas and take off. Let everything warm up, get right up to the right viscosities. And uh, that's your R71 SIP seven tip for the day. Uh, we want to thank you for supporting GCAP, Garden City Ammonia Program. And um, this is what I have for everybody. We'd like to get this out there and let people start knowing that we're going to give out some uh, educational tips. I'd like to give away a shirt and uh, we'll have an opportunity for this to get mailed out for you today. So it is the R717 I Love shirt from GCAP. This is our new instructor named Pablo. Uh, and when you come, you'll get the chance to meet him. So a way to win the shirt, I need you to like this post, I need you to share this post, I need you to comment another Ammonia Tech's name on this post. So here we go, ready, set, go. Keep it in the pipes, fellas.